Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. If your dream is to become a data analyst or a data scientist, then cracking the SQL interview round is a very important stage for attaining your dream. Myself, I am Malvi Prasad. I am a mentor for data science and analytics. I can help you overcome this obstacle by explaining all the various questions asked in the top companies which are already available in the LeetCode platform. All my code solutions for the questions available in LeetCode platform are there in my GitHub repository. The link for that is available in the description below. And in addition to that, I have segregated the channel into five playlists, namely easy, medium and hard depending upon the difficulty of the question. The premium subscription questions of LeetCode as premium playlist and I combined every two, one of them 230 questions into one single playlist and I have ordered in the ascending order of the sequence number. Let's see the question which I am trying to solve it today. It is type medium, question number 1831, maximum date transaction. Let's see the question. Okay, they have given a transaction table where they have transaction ID, day, amount. Okay. Write a SQL query to report the IDs of transaction with the maximum amount on their respective day. If on day there are multiple transactions, okay, return them all. Okay, order by transaction ID. Okay, they have given a sample database. Now what they want is on a particular day what is the highest transaction number if there are two amounts which are having same amount transaction we need to return two things for example what is the date here remove this date time only 2021 april 3rd remove this date this is 23rd if you remove this date these three transactions have been completed on one single day this is on one single day and this is the one single day if you see this is only one transaction so this is the highest this is also one transaction this is the highest if you see there are three transactions among 51 and 58 sorry 58 and 50 are the, the highest transaction so both should be written so what are the transaction ids of them 8 9 1 6 uh, okay i'm sorry there are two 28s my bad okay let's see it Let's remove the time and see by date. Okay, if you see April 3rd, only one date is there, but 28, there are two dates. One is 21, one is 50. Which one is highest? 40. So remove this date. This is also not required. Similarly, for 4 3, there is only one date. So this should be returned. For 4, this should be written. And there is one more date. April 29th there are two dates which is having 58 as both highest so these two things should be written okay so 8156 8156 they have uh, kept in the ascending order okay so what we need to do we need to extract from this day and create a rank function in the decreasing order of amount and let's filter for rank equal to 1 then we will get the highest amount Okay, first of all, let's extract the day from transaction select all rows comma rank over over partition by J. We need to what extract date from day. So partition by date of day and date of day will extract date from that order by amount descending okay let's call it rk let's run it here you can see it has given ratings of that right so now what we want only ranking ones transaction id okay Let's call it as some CTE. And from the CTE, uh, we want only rank 1. And where is this rank 1? We want transaction ID. 
we select transaction ID. Okay, let's run it. Uh, where is the mistake we are getting? Okay, they told you to order by transaction ID in ascending order. Okay, trans successfully, let's submit it. Okay, thanks for watching my video. And uh, just try to complete all the two, 230 plus questions which are there in my channel. You will be able to crack any SQL interview. Okay, just keep doing, keep practicing. You can crack any SQL ROM. Thanks for watching. One more time.